the Bible was written by different authors for different purposes. On such scripture written for different purpose is the book of Psalm. Today we will examine Psalm 27. Psalm 27 is a psalm of confidence in God, a plea for God's presence. It is structured so that the psalmist's expressions of confident trust include his prayer for deliverance. In verse 1 to 6, David expresses his complete confidence and trust in his God. In verses 7 to 12, he presents his petition for deliverance from his enemies. Some believe that Psalm 27 was written when David was fleeing from his rebellious son, Absalom. Others believe that verses 7 to 12 were written when life was difficult and David thought that God was hiding from him. Psalm ends with a take heart, which is a call to wait on the Lord. The entire psalm teaches, The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When the wicked, even mine enemies and my foes, came upon me to eat up my flesh, they stumbled and fell. Though an host should encamp against me, my heart shall not fear. Though war should rise against me, in this will I be confident. One thing have I desired of the Lord, that will I seek after, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord, and to inquire in his temple. For in the time of trouble, he shall hide me in his pavilion, in the secret of his tabernacle shall he hide me, he shall set me up upon a rock. And now shall mine head be lifted up above mine enemies round about me. Therefore will I offer in his tabernacle sacrifices of joy. I will sing, yea, I will sing praises unto the Lord. Hear, O Lord, when I cry with my voice. Have mercy also upon me, and answer me. When thou saidest, Seek ye my face. My heart said unto thee, Thy face, Lord, will I seek. Hide not thy face far from me. Put not thy servant away in anger. Thou hast been my help. Leave me not, neither forsake me, O God of my salvation. When my father and my mother forsake me, then the Lord will take me up. Teach me thy way, O Lord and lead me in a plain path because of mine enemies. Deliver me not over unto the will of mine enemies, for false witnesses are risen up against me, and as such as breathe out cruelty. I had fainted, unless I had believed to see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Wait on the Lord, be of good courage, and he shall strengthen thine heart. Wait, I say, on the Lord.